With VectorWorks Landmark 2010, it's even easier to create custom patios, walkways, driveways, and other landscape elements with the improved hardscape tool. We've made several improvements to the hardscape that will save you valuable time. First, let's take a look at the improvements to the hardscape tags. You can now display tags in a floating style. You can align the tags so that it is centered or underlined. Additionally, tags have the ability to be placed where you want to place them. As you can see, the tag will move to wherever we click. And you can also add a line marker to be displayed with the tag. Hardscape border behavior has also been improved. For pathway hardscapes, options have been added to set the borders to the left and right edges. In this example, we will uncheck the left and end, and you will see the border has been removed. You can also modify how the borders of boundary hardscapes show. Using the 2D Reshape tool in the Hide Show Edges mode, you can just click on the edge you want to show or hide. Clipping hardscapes has also been improved to create more flexible options for you. Now, when you run the Clip Surface command on a hardscape, a border is automatically created around the hole. Borders now also show in 3D, and separate textures can be assigned to the border from the Hardscape Settings dialog box. Going into the Hardscape Settings, we can choose a border texture, and then click OK, and then notice how the hardscape updates. Additionally, the main texture for the hardscape can be edited from the Render tab in the Object Info palette. These new hardscape capabilities will significantly improve your overall experience with creating and customizing hardscapes.